there's a county in New Jersey that will be one of the most expensive on the entire East Coast in a decade or two, and quite possibly the entire nation. And that county is Monmouth County, New Jersey. And yeah, I'm a little biased. I grew up here. I live here now. Call it home. Our company is here. Everything is here. But I'm going to show you exactly why this county is going to explode over the next two decades. The first part is the location itself of Monmouth County. You are on the eastern part of New Jersey, right in, yes, central New Jersey. You are an hour from New York City, you're an hour from Philadelphia, and you are an hour or less from Atlantic City. There's even tons of options to take a ferry right across the Hudson to New York City in less than 45 minutes. And along this coast, you have some of the nicest beaches on the entire east coast of the U.S. The schools are unbelievable. The amount of downtowns and small local restaurants and so many great amenities, parks, all of it are immense. And I haven't even gotten to the two other factors that are going to drive up prices for the next two decades in Monmouth County. The first of those is the massive studio, over $500 million studio, that Netflix is building right in the middle of Monmouth County. At what was Fort Monmouth, which was a military base. And this isn't just, you know, a small-time studio. They're building out this studio to be where most Netflix movies are filmed. And that's going to bring Hollywood-type exposure here to the East Coast. And whether that's a thing for you, you hate it, you love it, doesn't really matter. It's certainly going to appreciate home values in that immediate area as you have all this corporate Hollywood type of money coming in. And the last reason, again, whether you love it or hate it, is the fact that Monmouth County has so much land preserved under Green Acres. Green Acres was the county's and many towns' solution to preventing overdevelopment. They purchase land and they preserve it under the Green Acres program from the state so it can't be developed under a 100-year plan. You know, when that plan is up, could things change? Certainly. But many of these areas have 90, 80-plus years left on these Green Acres programs. So much of the county is developed. It doesn't look that way if you pull it up over a map. However, it is in terms of what actually will be able to be developed over the next 20 years. And part of that honestly sucks because so many young people, young couples, young families are getting completely priced out of the county now. However, it will change what the county looks like over the next 10 to 20 years from a quasi blue collar, white collar mix to a strictly very affluent, wealthy type of person that lives here. It's certainly up for debate whether that will be good for many in the county that live here now. However, it is what is most likely going to happen to Monmouth County over the next two decades.